Hello and welcome to episode 23 of Bobo Scrub Arty Records. Yay! Another week, Saturday today. Um, I tend to record every other week, so that's why we're still in 9.2. I expect 9.3 will be out by now, so this is going to start off by going out in the FE304 and this is obviously still going to be 9.2 gubbins so it should still be pretty good whether or not I'll actually do any good is yeah <laughs> I think the last few episodes have been difficult uh, it's been difficult to stay positive it's just part of the experiment of just playing artillery most of the time. It's uh, it can be extremely frustrating when you have you only, you only get a limited like myself. I only get a limited amount of matches each day, probably between eight and ten before I go to work. So you know if I lose eight out of the ten battles on a morning and do that for most of the week, it can be really difficult to carry on. But uh, yeah, so let's try and remain in high spirits and we'll see how this match goes. Yep. Sand River, 48% chance. Mm, we'll see. So we're attacking. And this is going to be interesting. I haven't really done Move out. this before with this wee artillery piece. So. Hmm entirely sure where I should start off by going. Um, one's kind of fumbling about a bit. Hmm. I think I'll try and stay roughly hidden. I don't really think I can get... No, you see I'm out of range there. I'm going to be out of range here as well. Um, I wonder if I could head down by the buildings over here and then kind of work my way around that way maybe. Hmm. No one's really going to get any early spots in up on the ridge there, so let's just hang back over this way a minute and we'll see what starts to turn up. This is going to go. Doopy do. Recording on a Saturday today, I had to pop over and help my mum and dad take up some flooring, which was great fun. So the wife said it was okay to do some recording today. It's a bit strange being a Saturday. Not been looking forward to be honest at trying to do some matches at the weekend but uh, <laughs> doobie doobie doo. some good spots at the moment so keep trying to get this guy if we can I haven't warmed up or anything, this is the first match I've had today since turning it on, so... Yeah. Enemy hit! Keep trying to pound this Indian Panzer for the time being. And then I might help with the Tiger. Oh, not... Tiger's just out of range anyway. Super. Okay. Oh, these guys are in range. And I guess that our team are going to be less keen on moving around the corner. Uh, I could move over and try and help the other guys. Mm, maybe I didn't pick a very good position. This T-43 looks like he might be popping up around. Let's see if you can spot anything for us. Yeah, come on, move on up a bit. 
Maybe I should carry on trying to trying to hit that Indian panzer. Yeah, screw it. Too far away to be able to help any of those guys. <clears throat> Damn it. This guy around here, then. Critical hit. Twenty <laughs> fives having a good run. Don't think I've been spotted yet, which is good. Ah, that E twenty five is. I wonder if he's going to come back. Enemy hit. Or if he's going to head round. Looks like he's headed round. Okay. Let's see if we can go intercept this. This little guy. <sighs> Never mind. I don't really know what I was thinking there. I probably could have gone round him. But, yeah, let's leave that there. So, while that one's... We're waiting for that one to come back. thought I'd run through. I'm very nearly there, being able to afford the object. So, I've been having a look at crews. I'm going to move the 212A's crew up and I was having a look to see what crew I'm going to put in the 212A. So I've already changed over the commander. There's the commander that was in the 212A and this was the only other guy, the best other commander that I had. Um, so I thought I'd stick him in there and I've been having a look to see the aiming time has suffered from not having brothers in arms anymore the the aiming circle takes a little bit longer to, to zone in uh, but hopefully it shouldn't take too long to get him up to a hundred percent and then we'll be laughing because everybody else should already have at least two perks so my is3 crew i think i will use or maybe um these guys i think his percentage is higher so i'll probably end up using my is3 crew so with the driver the same IS3 crew and with the radio operator I think I'll use the T3485 crew um, and be able to stick brothers in arms and then uh, camouflage then for the first loader I've got one of the IS3s there and then I've grabbed one out of the KV-2 to be honest I don't use the KV-2 too often and I'm, I'm kinda used to the crew being a bit naff and I'd rather have a decent crew in this machine so once this commander gets up to 100% on his second perk then we know that brothers in arms will be back in action again and we'll be laughing which will be good and then this crew can move up to the object and I've seen some gameplay in in the object and I think uh, I'm, I'm really gonna like it so yeah oh this guy's back it's a defeat it's not too much of a surprise did a little bit of damage so it's not too bad and we didn't make a loss so yeah that's cool could go out again in him later so how much left have we got so just under 300,000 maybe another week or so might have that yeah I was thinking then of maybe using some of my free XP and start researching some of the things for the T54 because I think I'd like to to purchase the T54 next so speaking of the 212A let's go out in it and have a look at how this aiming circle is affected now we have the new commander well, here we are on Ensk. Mm. 
63% chance to win. I've asked them if we're going to be taking the field and it looks like we're going to try. I'm still not too keen on moving over into the field. Um, so I'm going to head over this way a little bit. I've never been entirely happy with some of the places I sit on this map so it might be worth starting to try and experiment. But I'm going to sit here for the time being just so I don't get spotted too much. Anyone that tries to rush. Ooh, interesting. Don't know if I can get some splash on this guy. Possibly. Maybe. Let's give this a go. Let's let it come in. You see how much longer the aiming time is just without bells and arms. So hopefully that splashed him a little bit. Make it want to move a little bit. I'm gonna have to keep an eye. It doesn't look like many people went this way, which is good. So. Yeah. Looks, like... Looks like we got hit there, don't you? Yeah, I think so. Might be worth us moving after this shot then. Hopefully, he probably thinks that we've moved. Yeah, that is that just shows that it might be worth us moving in future. <laughs> Let's keep an eye out for this little chaffy. Maybe I should move out into the field a little bit. I'm still a little bit hesitant when it comes to uh, trying to take a shot on the move. I really do panic. It's like I almost I, I don't want to miss the shot so much that you know I yeah. nicely done. Rain here. Hmm. I'm oh, just in a terrible spot, aren't I? If I can get some shots over on these things, no, <laughs> of course not. Might be able to help these guys out though. This waffle's not going to be too keen. Let's wait for the same in time again. And that looked like it probably missed. It's interesting. Like I said, my luck's been absolutely awful. I know his aim time's fairly quick. It's probably worth us trying to get this guy instead. I'm sure I'm going to get used to this aim time again. God, it's taken a while really is slow when you first start off. I suppose I think the crew has been good enough that every time I've every time I've been out in this ever since I bought it I've always had brothers in arms so this is a new experience for me I guess. I don't think we'll get reloaded in time to get any more damage on him. No. And there we are. Lovely. Knock that tree over. Rah. It's a victory, but we did terribly. So we only managed to hit him and we did bugger all. So, good start, hey. Awesome. Let's just resupply him. 
good to good. Lovely jubbly. I think we'll go out in the Lorraine. I've, in the week, finished researching, which is nice. That engine, I was right that when we did the 51, uh, the engine automatically unlocked. So I thought, screw it, buy it. And yeah, which is good. I don't know who you are. So yes, let's go out in the Lorraine. We can possibly try out the new engine and hopefully actually do some damage. So here we are on Karelia. 37% chance to win. Hmm. It's assault as well. So we'll be defending. Parti. Defending on this map. It's interesting in artillery. It's difficult to stay hidden if the attacking team gets some scouts up it's just really hard to find somewhere so I think I'm gonna try I might have tried this before I'm gonna try sitting over here and primarily aim in this direction over this way and then up here and if a scout tries to come up here we need to kind of hug this rock because they'll spot us because they'll come up there now helping these guys over here might be a little bit more tricky from where we are but you know what I've never tried it so let's let's turn around and actually see how far over I need to be so I can actually get over this way which is not too bad but obviously then it stops here because I'm sat by a rock so at least if they do push over to this side I know that I can help them out a little bit seeing as though they're so far back I might be able to move over slightly keep an eye on helping out the KV-4 up there looks like he's got an IS and a Panther 2 so doesn't look like I'm going to be able to get any shots on this Centurion looks like he might end up being staying there so let's see if we can help this guy out well that's a heavy hit from the jag time and that was really short so these guys have these French artillery have a, a lower trajectory as well. Mm. Need to be careful because I haven't got six cents on this tank either. I'm going to take a pop shot. And that looked like it went long. See if we can get any more shots down south here. Hmm. That's not good, is it? They're pushing really very well over here. Hmm. Okay. Can't wait to help these guys out. some shots on this guy. No I can't. Not from where I am anyway. I can't see this object if he goes far enough back. Good. Oh that was close. So now, I'm stuck. But that doesn't mean I can't get some shots on possibly these guys. I can. It's looking too hot at the moment. Yeah. 
Ils ont failli nous avoir. Oh. God is lucky. Oh, this isn't looking too great, is it? Hmm. What are we going to do now? I think we're probably mostly screwed. Out, I'm just gonna get over. Oh no, we might be able to get something on this Panther too. In Pershing. We'll oh, get shot in the ass. Yeah. It's almost like I've forgotten how to play the game, isn't it? Never mind. <laughs> was a defeat, not surprisingly, and we did 129 damage. That's just super. Still didn't make a loss, but then it is only what, tier 7? Okay. <laughs> well, that'll be it for this episode. I'm sorry I suck. Hopefully in the next one I'll be a little better. So, thank you for watching. <laughs> See you next time.